what is the name of your homeboy's WhatsApp group? Now, I don't say homeboys, so whoever did this needs to be sacked. <laughs> I What's don't that? think I can say it. <laughs> is it embarrassing? I think it's called like like Daddy Chill or something. Daddy Chill? Yeah, it's very strange. Okay. It was like this. Daddy Chill. <laughs> Yo, it's your boy H for like the source, Harry Panera, and I'm here with Gaffer and Puma, and this is another episode of Passcode. Now listen, I'm with the one and only, the young, aspiring, future Christian Pulisic. How you doing today, my brother? I'm doing great, man. Well, so, obviously you've had a great summer, you know, Champions League winner. Had a nice preseason? Yeah, yeah, definitely. Enjoyed okay, my summer. Stop smiling. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I'm gonna try and get to know you through your phone. Let's do it. I'm gonna ask you a few questions and let's just get straight into it, all right? So what is your phone lock screen? It's a picture of my team, uh, the national team, winning the Nations League, lifting a trophy with my team. So, oh, how was and, that for you, man? Uh, that was sick as well. Um, and then actually, like, the home background is, like, the Champions League lifting the trophy. So I got, like... Oh, so he's got uh, multiple trophies. Yeah, a couple trophies. <laughs> Who is the admin for Chelsea WhatsApp group? Who's in control? I feel like Jorginho, like, no matter what, yeah. he's commenting on whatever's in there. Apparently, so he's, <laughs> he's quite a funny person. He's, yeah. He's what? funny, man. Yeah, Nothing funny about him on the pitch, though. No, nah, no, nah. nah, he's he's a serious guy. Who's the guy that reads everything and never replies? For some reason, I think that's you. That's me. Yeah, I can tell. Yeah, you ain't got time for this stuff. And who's the guy that leaves voice notes? Now I can't stand people that leave like three-minute voice notes. Oh if you want to sing a song, go to record a studio. You. I 100% you know I mean? agree. I never send voice messages. Olivier Drew always did last year. Like, he just wants to hear his voice, innit? Yeah. He, yes, Christian. Yeah, he's, he loves. Yes, I want to see you later. He loves the voice messages. Yeah, yeah. It's a good accent. Yeah, no, it's really good. Thanks, yeah. man. What gaming apps? or Netflix shows do you watch when traveling to games? Like? I love watching Twitch. I love watching like different gamers. Play Are you a gamer yourself? A bit, yeah. But lately I've just been playing like online chess. I'm oh, like, wow. obsessed with chess. What's the last track you Shazammed or searched for? I actually want to know your, your music I heard this. Well. I heard this song. I think it was like on a video game or something. I don't remember, but I, I Shazammed it. And it's yeah. Bad Ones by Tate McRae. Right. Edit, oh, well, let's songs. get that bouncing off in the background. Yeah, get that clear. good song. You know what I'm saying? Good song. What is the current winning song in a Chelsea slash United States men's team dressing room? Hmm. Or specifically, what was the song when you guys think, won the Champions League? Yeah, like the song when we won the Champions League. Yeah. It was a, it was a Meek Mill song. Um, me, do you know what? You know, like I used to pray for times like, like this, this to run like, like this. So I had to. Do you yeah. know me and Meek Mill share the same birthday? Do you? Yeah. And some people say we look alike. <laughs> He's from my, you know, Pennsylvania. That's, that's where I'm from. That's where my people are from. Yeah. Wow, we're kind of close. We might be family. Yeah, it could be. We actually might be family. What is the name of your personal pre-match playlist? Pre-game bangers. Oh wow, yeah. pre-game bangers. Yeah, you PGB. Know you, yeah, you know you're gonna get some bangers in there. Yeah. You know the song. Future song, last name, like future a little bit. You're moving. I feel that's, like that's, me and you could go out together. Like, I could give you the yeah, yeah, that's, Okay, cool. That's I like that. Banger, future. That You're one of the goats. What was your initiation song? Oh, <laughs> have you heard this before? <laughs> no, I, do you know what? I haven't. Luckily for you, I haven't. Okay, my, I would have been singing my with initiation you right now. Uh, song, when I, when I got to Chelsea, I had to say it was terrible. Like, I had to go up. We, I just arrived in Japan, yeah. went to dinner, and they were like, you have to sing right now. And the only song I could think like that I knew the lyrics to yeah. was a uh, party in the USA by Miley Cyrus. Oh. So I, I had to go up and, and I I sang it proud and with your chest. I got a good reaction. That's good. That's all that yeah. matters. You gotta yeah. do it with your chest, man. Yeah, no, so I, I sang it loud, I stood up on a chair and had to be done. That's the one thing that I'll never understand. Why people like it? love watching that. Yeah. I cringe. Like yeah. when you watch a young kid coming up, he's gotta do it, you're like let this be over, you know. Well, you done it. Shout out yeah. to Miley. What is your most liked Instagram photo? It the must be. Movie. It must be uh, the one after the Champions League, though. Yeah. I would think. If I had to guess. Is that a photo that you've looked at so many times? Uh, yeah. You couple, should get a massive one. Couple times in the house. <laughs> that seems a bit. Yeah, put it right there. I'll come and help you. Don't worry, we'll speak okay. about that later. Which one of your Instagram followers were you most gassed to see follow you? Jack Harlow. Like Jack Harlow. Jack Harlow. You know, I saw cool, he was. Man. Yeah, he like. I saw him in a picture wearing a Chelsea jersey, and then I was yeah. like, wait, and I saw he was following me. I was like, oh. It's mad. Yeah. yeah shout out to Jack Harlow, yeah. man. I like his music a lot. In your opinion, which Instagram account should we all be following? Now, you can do self promo here. I would. <laughs> nah, I got enough followers. Oh! Nah, I'm, <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> Go follow my dog on Instagram. Yeah. Yeah. What's the Instagram page? I think it's like 
Finley the Iggy or something like that. Go shout out Finley the yeah, Iggy, go, man. Yeah, go. Which has been your favorite moment shared with a fan on social media? I love the one uh, where a kid kind of runs on onto the pitch and I'm doing like an interview. They like kind of try to pull him away, secure. You know, they're doing their job. Yeah, they yeah, have yeah. to like protect, you know, the, whatever the players and stuff. But and I said like, no, it's okay. Come and we took a picture and he was really excited and like I thought that was pretty cool. What is the last picture saved on your camera roll? The last picture is my dinner last night. What did you have for dinner? Uh, it, it was like some risotto, like chicken, spicy vegetables. It was healthy. Very nice. Yeah, healthy, healthy, as well. healthy but delicious. Okay, yeah. cool. Risotto. Obviously, yeah. you know, right now I'm not really feeling Italian food for obvious reasons. You know, still heartbroken. But we move. What is the one video on your phone that you always find yourself rewatching? Probably this. There's a video of like us after the Champions League, and yeah. I just randomly started taking a, a video in the changing room of like Andreas or something. Yeah. And then Aspie like just ran in with the trophy, and like we all he lifted it, and it's like the sickest video in the world. Everyone's just going crazy, yeah, champagne can't relate. everywhere. You know, can't so. relate at all. Still <laughs> hoping. You know, what is the best holiday snap you've taken in 2021? Probably like me and some of my friends. Uh, like jumping off the, the roof into my pool in my place in Florida. What is the most underrated phone app we should all be getting on? I really like House Party. I don't know if you, that was like an old thing, wasn't it? You was there. Yeah. I didn't know. I wasn't in your rooms. Oh, well. Oh, exclusive rooms, innit? Yeah, yeah you can't get in those rooms. Yeah, they're pretty exclusive. What was it about House Party that you enjoyed? I don't know, like, like I feel like the group FaceTime is not yeah. as good. Like something about the House Party vibe, it's got yeah. the different backgrounds, you can just talk and it's, I don't know. It's nice yeah, to me, that was voice. a lockdown, during the lockdown. Man. Yeah. When we was yeah, bored. Yeah. You don't use it anymore, are you? Honestly, I still do sometimes. Oh, okay, <laughs> like sick. Occasionally with my friends from home. What is your screen time saying? Every Monday when you get a notification, how many hours are you racking up? Now, I'm just going to be honest with you, Christian. Um, I checked mine on Monday when it, when uh -huh. it, checked it, it came up. It was 12 hours. That's pretty bad. That's, yeah. That's pretty bad. So Mine is saying daily average about five, five and a half hours. So, wow. Look, it makes sense. Almost. That's good. Five hours is all right. I think the average yeah. must be seven. That still just seems... Too much, isn't too, it? Like, how did... There's no way I spent five hours on this thing. Well, I mean, look, I'm 12 hours, okay. so... <laughs> I guess I Makes you feel much better. I don't know. What one emoji do you think is missing? I don't know. The Champions League trophy or something? Ooh. Something, you know. Hashtag UCL. Yeah, or yeah, something Chelsea, you know. I mean, I mean uh, Apple, if you're watching, you know. Who is the most famous person in your phone book? I don't say me because that's cheating. I guess it would probably be like one of my teammates. Who's the most famous one of my teammates, would you say? Ooh. And Golo Kante. Oh, come on. Kante. Kante or Mount? Because obviously Mount's a star boy. He is a star you know, boy, yeah. So I say Mount. And There's a lot of uh, yeah big names in there. but Can I, I ask you about Angola? Because obviously we know how much of an amazing player yeah. he is. Um, what's he like off the field? Like, Does he say, is he a man of a few words? Yeah, he's definitely a man of few words, but he's he's a funny guy. I think like <laughs> the way people, well, how they think he is, is yeah. kind of how he is. Yes. <laughs> like He's so <laughs> humble and like the nicest guy to talk to, but he's also... Like we always play these little games and chess and like stuff like that and he's super competitive so yeah yeah i he can gets imagine. angry if he loses I can imagine. what is the last google or internet search that you made yesterday i was sent a text that my landlord is sending me a, a hamper oh a hamper bag yeah a hamper bag okay but she just, like she just said they're sending you a hamper and in america a hamper is like what you put laundry in okay so you googled it and so I, I was like, why is she sending me a hamper? I was like, I don't, what, like, that would be weird, yeah. right? So I Googled it. I was like, what is a hamper? And then I found out it's like a little gift basket type thing with like food or, I guess. So she's showing her appreciation. Yeah, yeah, it was amazing. Very I was rich. Very thankful. But yeah, I, man. Yeah, I had to know what I'll that do was. that if I was your landlord. I'd be like, damn, keep paying. Who, How long do you think you can live without your phone? I think the world would be in a better place if no one had a phone. That's my opinion. I might but, cry. But I love, but I, I like, I love my phone. I, I get my schedule every day. I need my phone. You know? Yeah. Phone. Wow. Something just came up here. I don't know how this happened here. It says, "When will you give Harry his signed shirt with his name on the back?" I did. I see it. Yeah. Mm. I guess. ASAP. Yeah, man. Well, you know what? That's been Gaffer and Puma. I've been Harry Panera. He's been Christian Pulisic, my new best friend. Subscribe for more content coming your way.